Hi, welcome to the Big Bear Homestead. And I know it's been a while, so let's catch up. Okay, today I'm gonna do a real quick like vlog, try to catch you guys up on what's really been going down here on the homestead. I know it's been a while since we put out any type of vlog or, or video, and that was because we were having issues with our audio on our DSLRs and we just couldn't figure it out and so we ordered a uh, some type of a thing that hooks up to the GoPro that I can hook up the uh, external microphone with to be able to use and so that came in uh, came in Saturday so it came in yesterday and uh, so I'm gonna do a vlog today so what have we been doing here on the homestead well, we've been battling the heat in the garden. You guys will see that on the, uh, we're gonna do a garden tour on Wednesday, so you guys will, will catch you back up on that. But one of the things that we've been doing is with this old chicken coop right here. We uh, started clearing out this area of the homestead. Now this old chicken coop, we threw up real fast when we first moved here about five or six years ago. I can't believe it's even somewhat, still standing um <clears throat> but mother nature took it all over well blaze has been cleaning it up this weekend and we're going to fix it up and we're going to put uh robin's calling them our chitchens our chitchen chit something anyway you had to ask her but basically we're going to have a small flock of chickens in here that we are going to just use just for us um it's going to be for educational purposes for when folks come and uh folks come to visit we can show them of, of a way to predator uh, make it more predator resistant not predator proof because there's no such thing as a predator proof chicken coop um, but to make it more predator resistant and so that way maybe they they can take some of that if they do this Ooh, don't mean junk it around right there that, that way if they have a coop with a run they'll be able to make theirs more predator resistant so we're gonna basically kind of rebuild it uh, make it look semi pretty get it ready and throw some chickens in there that we can use uh, harvest their eggs and use here on our just for our consumption and then the rest of the remaining hens and a couple of roosters will go on the egg mobile that way we can sell those eggs also right over here we also remembered this old duck coop <laughs> that we put up so we're gonna reclaim all this fencing back the T posts <coughs> that little coop back the bricks and stuff and then we're also going to continue to clear out this area here but those will all be later videos but I just wanted like I said I just wanted to do a real quick vlog kind of bring you up to speed of why we were kind of MIA there for a little while and uh, to let you know that here we come we're gonna be putting more videos out more vlogs this is my vlog robin's going to be doing a vlog this week um, we're going to have the garden tour this week and then we'll probably we're going to have a how to build your own bat boxes this week our how-to video so be looking forward to those we've got lots of different projects and stuff coming up that we are going to bring you guys along the way again we apologize for those two weeks being out we literally had to wait on this one piece and uh, with the GoPro Hero 5 and 7, these things are out of stock just about everywhere. You have to order it on the internet. And uh, it took it two weeks to get here. I know Daryl from Two Family Homestead, he's been trying to get one for a while. <coughs> the old Bruder box, Bruder house. Take a look at it now because the next time you guys see it, it's going to look completely different, I promise. And uh, shop barrels there's gonna be something that comes down with the barrels and uh whoo that was a bee so again we apologize that it's been so long since we put anything out but uh you guys will start to get content on a regular basis we're gonna be dancing around to try to figure out what's the best time for us to put the video out so if you guys have any comments questions or uh, suggestions uh, please put them in the comments below and uh, we'll see you in the next video thanks for coming by the Big Bear Homestead 
God bless and have a nice day. Thank you.